on YouTube. This is Computer Tips. Uh, today I'm gonna show you how to get rid of um, key loggers and any other harmful stuff like spyware. Alright, so first go to google.com and then type in spybot. Search and destroy. Once you do that, you're gonna click on the first um result right up here on the top or if you don't want to go to the actual website i recommend any besides the, the actual website to use download.cnet.com because they check their programs and make sure they don't have viruses in it all right so i'm going for this tutorial i'm going to be using the the site the real site but if you just type in spybot like I'm gonna do now it's gonna take you right here and you wanna click this and it's what's well, not doing it for me but it will take you to a page and you just wanna click on scroll down and find English once you do that it will bring you to this page then I'm gonna you're gonna click spybot um whoops okay so Okay, so, um, then we're gonna click right over here, Spy by Search and Destroy, click Download. Then you're gonna scroll down and find the first result. And you're gonna click Download here, as you see. And now, then click right here. and then download ship again this window should pop up click save file depending on your browser mines will bring up firefox as you can see i already downloaded it and then you go to your downloads folder it should be right And once you click that, you should bring this window up. I already have it, but I'm not gonna go through all the steps. I'm just gonna take you through the first beginning. Then you pick your language and click OK. Click Next. I accept the agreement. Next. Next. And next, next, and then you click install and just wait until it, it finishes installing. Once it's done, um, it should start up right away. I'm gonna quit it because I already have it running on my computer. I'm gonna bring it up. See, as you can see, I just finished doing a scan. And it's just finishing up. I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna pause this video and wait until it finished fixing my problems. As you see now, it says it's fixed all my spywares. So I'm gonna click OK. Anyway, once you have a window should have come up saying back up your registry you're gonna click yes and then once you do that the window's probably gonna stay the same and then on the bottom corner there's gonna be one, a button that says next you're gonna keep clicking next to it says start using the program once you click that you wanna go to search for updates alright once you search for the updates you're gonna scroll down find securitywonks.net as you see here it doesn't matter but if you wanna pick the one I picked I use the second one and then you just click and then continue and then just click download see it won't look the same because I already have downloaded the file but I'm gonna click 
exit. Then once you're done that, you want to go to mode, and you want to go to advanced mode. Then click yes. And then you're going to go down to settings, file, files, and you want to scroll all the way down and click usage tracking and track that UT. And then click that. And then you just exit out of this and go back here. And then you can go ahead and ch check check for problems. Then click hi now. And then it should start checking. And in a few minutes, as you see right over here, down here, it says running bot check 160. That's all the files that's being checked right now. As you see, all this. And when this bar gets filled up, that means the check is over. But I'm going to click stop check because I already completed my checks. As you saw when I first brought up the program, I was already done. So, I'm just going to click stop check. And you see now, it says, user abort scan was not complete successfully. Well, on this window right here, it will be all the problems, all the stuff that I found, as you saw in the beginning. And then, you click over here. Right here, this area. And when you click like this. Like, let's say this was a spy where you click it, it should say information about it. But since this isn't, it won't say anything. So once it's done, you just click, you just hit up here, fix, select problems, and then you're done. Now, to protect yourself while you're on the internet, you're going to go ahead and go to where it says immunize, right here. And... You're gonna click that. Open browser detected. And it's gonna tell you you should close all the browsers. Because you shouldn't have them open. But I'm not gonna do that. Because uh, I w I'm making the video. So. Once that's done. You let this load up. And then you just click immunize. Right up here. The first one. Once you click that, the bar should fill up again, and then you're done, and you're ready to surf safely in the internet. And that's it. I hope you guys subscribe, and visit my website. And right over here, as you see, I already have a couple tutorials. Well, this is just the basic stuff that you need to know, like what is an ISP network browser internet and last URLs. Many people don't know what that means. Anyway, I'll have it up there and I'll have the direct download link. So enjoy it and I hope you guys rate, comment, and subscribe.